today is just Tuesday night, you know. Yeah, so I decided to do this video to show you guys uh, the final part of the longest highway here in the Gambia. You know, I started this video at just uh, Sting Corner, not far from here, but the place is very, very dark because there is no light, you know. There is no light, so I just started the video like just after the Johnson, just after the Johnson. So I will be driving towards uh, maybe Senegambia. From there, I go to Turn Table, you know. can see the highway it's uh, very nice the Gambia is really so amazing right at the moment you know yeah so I'm around I'm around Joshua heading towards uh, through the traffic light but you can see what we got along the highway you know you can see what we got along the highway it's a roundabout you know you can see the road signs also that indicates uh, the speed or something that's just in the in front of you maybe you will just know how to drive here is a roundabout you know it's a roundabout the first roundabout from here the first roundabout of Joshua yeah the first roundabout of Joshua so I'll just make a U-turn and then I show you guys around old Joshua the first roundabout here so this is the first roundabout. I will just continue heading towards uh, Senegambia. You can see people just uh, sitting along the roadside, trying to enjoy. They are really enjoying the highway, you know. Everything is clear. You can just drive anyhow, you know. You can just drive anyhow. And then uh, the highway, one thing in this uh, highway is like, not a busy highway whereby you will just come and then say ah, this traffic is kind of the traffic is jam you know or, you know yes so drive with me we go towards uh, Senegambia and then you can see the new Gambia here you can see the new Gambia so each roundabout has maybe this you can see when you come here you have to reduce your speed limit limit your speed rather after limiting your speed you can just see the crossing lane wherever if you see a person standing by you can just give the person a way to cross you know yeah so this is the second roundabout i will just do as the same this is the roundabout of pakao pakao roundabout so i will make a you quick u-turn and then I just continue towards a uh, traffic light. Towards a uh, traffic light. So there we go. You have another crossing lane here for people to cross. Yes. Uh, this is a new video that I decided to do at night due to this traffic uh, this one sometimes. So because during the night the traffic is used, uh, the traffic used to be like very fast and then you know yeah because you can see it by yourself it's almost 11 p.m here uh, very soon 12 a.m here in west africa this is why it goes we just passed Paco johnson we are just heading towards uh, traffic light which is around one of the busiest uh, business centers here in West Africa uh, in Gambia you know yes you can see the Gambia it's really amazing you know it's really amazing this highway is one of the best and then the biggest project here in the Gambia that have the biggest uh, development that have ever happened in the Gambian history you know 
after crossing the two roundabouts here you have the first uh, the first flyover from Sting Corner from Sting Corner the first flyover from Sting Corner heading towards Senegambia so this is the first flyover you can just drive with me today showing you the OIC at night yes you can stay tuned watch the video till the end and then I know people would love to see this video as you know the latest uh, development here in the camp you know I wish you were here and then see it by yourself see it by yourself so I will just make a drive going straight sleeping police you limit your speed and then you start over again so after starting over you go straight uh, yes Gambia is really beautiful it's very very nice really developing you can see it by yourself this highway from Sting Corner straight to airport you can go straight from Sting Corner to airport you know there's a petrol station logics we have story buildings you know see these signboards that shows your destination so after passing go to your roundabout here I am Palmarima I'm around Palmarima it's also a roundabout you know from Palma no yeah this is Palmarima's uh, roundabout yes it's a very popular beach it's called Palmarima it's on the right side when you are from uh, Sting Corner when you are from Senegambia, it's on the left side. So this is the roundabout. You can see the surrounding. You have the taxis down there. You know, that's the Johnson right over there. So there we go. We're very close to Senegambia. You can see we have amazing bars. This is Maroon Supermarket. You know. Maroon uh, supermarket. This is back 
Kadaji, they have a gym center. They have everything. It's a hotel, restaurant, bar, you know. But I don't know if they have a club there. I don't know if they have a club. We are very close to Senegambia. We are now heading towards Senegambia. Very nice place. Half tropic. One of the biggest shopping centers here in the Gambia now. The days. You come here every Sunday. You know. You see so many amazing. You know. You can see like this is what we have in Senegambia. You know, I'm very close to Senegambia. I parked somewhere else, just not far from the Johnson. I just passed a uh, tropic. You can see right there. That's tropic, so you can see where that car is. That's Senegambia, you know. It has a roundabout, you know. You can see this is the surrounding around Senegambia. It's uh, 12 a.m. right at the moment. I started the video like uh, 11 p.m. towards uh, 12 a.m. You know, you can see right here. Is these are apartments, you know. Yeah, so I will just continue the video here, going straight to Tonte, maybe Costello too. So stay tuned, watch the video, give the video like and comment, you know. And please don't forget to share as much as you can. So we are just uh, moving again. I uh, was just stopped here in Senegambia, like a little, some minutes, you know. Yeah, so today, uh, right now, we are Senegambia, Senegambia Junction, you know. We are leaving Senegambia. I have to slow down, limit my speed. From there, I continue again. So this is Senegambia. It's just a highway video. Maybe sometime I will come and then do the video around Senegambia. You know, yeah. So we are heading towards. Once you come up to this uh, slab, you have to remi uh, reduce your speed. If not, it will damage your car, you know. So, if you just want to visit the Gambia here and then you are using this highway, you are a tourist. Be careful when driving because this highway uh, is full of these slabs that they just put in the middle of the highway so that you can just. Uh, reduce your speed you know they put these things here maybe to limit our to, or to limit the, inc accident, the incidents that has been occurred since this highway has been constructed you know we have so many incidents but since we bring these uh, slabs alhamdulillah it has reduced the, uh, the, 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 the amount of accidents that we used to have you know yeah, so from Senegal, 
Zambia I'm just coming to have this one of uh, Coco Ozone I'm very near, not far from Coco Ozone now so from Senegambia I have Kasumai which is almost uh, which is Benjolo Johnson yes, Benjolo